Hello YouTube and everyone. My name's Henio. This is Henio. This is Henio reacts to the blind box, the bird box. I'm sorry. Uh, I just finished watching the bird box, and I gotta say it's uh, it was very interesting. Um, here I'm just gonna talk about my reaction to it, the kind of thoughts that I have. Uh, I do have a, a review. I uh, hope maybe I'll be able to post that. Uh, it is uh, it is great, but um, just to dive into the material. Uh, I thought it was great, of course, the whole concept. If you if you haven't seen Bird Box on Netflix, then uh, probably going to be spoilers. I don't know what is going to be a spoiler and what isn't, but um, disclosure. <laughs> so uh, with Bird Box, of course, what happens is uh, they. Uh, it turns out that a disability that we all have spent our life, you know, probably looking down upon. Uh, you know, uh, anybody with a disability, really, or any kind of um, uh, marginalization, as I've said in in, in another sh uh, program, uh, if you're marginalized in any way, it, it, it kind of, you're uh, you're a deviant from society, and you're looked down upon in some ways, and you're not treated with the utmost. That's what gave this bird box uh, its power, of course, because in the end, being blind, uh, the uh, all of a sudden, what was a normal uh, life for the the blind individuals now has now uh you know to them there was no worry nothing had changed their life had not changed at all of course to everyone else they had to adapt so a few things here uh right uh, one thing that comes to mind is how we can become so used to something uh that's one thing the film is trying to push is we we lose appreciation for it we take things for granted um now this ties into um what I always talk about, about returning to the harmony of the universe that we were once a part of. We're supposed to be a, an energy, uh, uh, kind of like those beings that goes around, without, but, but, but a positive one, a good one, without any kind of a physical form. And so um, the, the, the physical form and everything is, that's a part of it, including sight, including taste and sound and all of that. We have seen other movies where, where they have uh, similar th things going on with sound and with uh, with being similar things where where the where nature is is, is the bad guy well uh, it does indicate that we're, you know we need to be aware of taking these for granted all of the things that are brought to us by the physical uh, form are actually put there because uh as a, as a task or obstacle we're supposed to the goal in our journey in life to enlightenment or, or whatever um you know achieving full cosmic power is to um identify these having a mental awareness we just have to identify them in the mind and then clear them away and so uh, this this movie, uh, Bird Box, does a great job in in uh, in isolating that variable of sight. Um, people with fa you have to have faith. I talk about it being a faith driven world. This represents that as well. It depicts it uh, because um, you know you kind of have to have. The more your faith grows, uh, the the less you need your sight. As your sight is your you know decreases, your faith grows, and so. Uh, it, it speaks to that, so that is that holds true here. We actually will be able to test all of the laws of the universe in any movie or in any kind of situation. So that's actually how you derive the laws of the universe. So Bird uh, Bird Box, what else can I say about it? Is very good movie, um, very thought provoking, I should say. Uh, it is it is neat. This had a metaphysical uh, uh, abs aspect i suppose um one of the guys in the movie talked about them being demons and so i think it gives people who need a full ex explanation uh some closure as to what's going on but uh the idea is is, is to leave open-minded uh you know for everyone else to kind of dive into what what could be causing it because um in this case blindness was uh was something that helped the disability but um and it was they had a physical aspect to it, but this could also have more of like a, a biological aspect, or maybe somebody of a certain race, or uh, all of a sudden um, isn't affected by something because of something in their genes, or something someone with a condition or a cancer. There are certain situations where somebody uh, take the hero Deadpool, uh, who is just affected by a cancer. He's an example of something that we normally can see, can see as morbid and, and sad, or, 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 or as a, a deficiency like being blind. Um, that's also one of the points this movie's trying to make. Blindness is not a deficiency. We are a full human without that blindness. And this movie put that on, on level ground. Um, you know, there, I don't want to make these too long. There's so much more we can say. Uh, the kids uh, were a big deal. I mean, the, this, this pushed a new life into things. This pushed uh, the, the importance of faith, the importance of, of uh, building things around that faith, uh, you know, uh, having an, a vision in your mind. I always, uh, I always discussed how 
I always discuss how the universe will pull out the, our deepest thoughts. And that's exactly what they were trying to do to the kids. They were trying to embed them with visions in their hearts so that the universe could pull them out and make them uh, make them become a reality. So Tom uh, in the movie did, did point out the, the need for that. Uh, and that's what they're doing. They're trying to build a vision, an unconscious vision that the kids can grow up having. And it'll come true because the universe will identify with that and pull it out. So it is important to push this. Um, also maternity and uh, uh, was a big deal. The, 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 the forward moving of life and energy, uh, the contrast of good and bad with the demons and then uh, her um, realizing her purpose. You know, we all have to have a purpose and and uh, we see the effects of not having a purpose when you're, you're unable to, if you don't define things and you can't really build on them. This This goes back to the foundation I've talked about because she wasn't able to even call boy or girl by, by any name or define her relationship or, or who she was. But as she learned to do that, uh, she she created a, a firm foundation to build a ladder on like we've discussed in the past. And so she was able to... to uh, to find a lot more fulfillment in what she was doing and and uh, have some direction in life and this 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 is all uh, um, this is all kind of uh, what what it's reflecting it's kind of the journey that we all need to be going through uh, so Bird Boxman there's so much I could say it's a great movie uh, everyone should check it out it's broken records it's uh, 45 million uh, uh, account holders right now on Netflix uh, have watched it in the first seven days it was released on the 21st so it's a very um, it's record breaking, of course, but uh, so I wanted to get get on this train and talk about it. Maybe um, this is kind of a review as well, but definitely a reaction with all of the thoughts that it has provoked. Uh, if you guys have any feedback or would like me to do any video on anything else, definitely submit a write about it. Other than that, uh, this is Hennio reacts to Bird Box, and thanks, guys. We'll catch you soon.